The online streaming giants have opened up a wealth of documentaries and series for those who like their viewing to be on the spooky side. So whether you have a taste for playing armchair detective when watching crime shows, or whether you prefer hiding behind a pillow whilst paranormal teams show you their best captured evidence, we have a little something for everyone here. So let's take a look at them. I'm Adam, this is What Culture Horror, and here are 10 creepy TV shows and documentaries you need to stream today. Number 10. Portals to Hell, Prime and Discovery Portals to Hell is an American paranormal reality show hosted by Katrina Weidman and Jack Osborne. The show has been going since 2019, where it was initially aired on the Travel Channel. As of today, the show has aired three seasons, 39 episodes in total, each running to about 45 minutes, and can be viewed on Prime and Discovery. Weidman and Osborne travel to various properties across America where they seek to investigate the history and paranormal accounts associated with each location. For both stars of the show, the aim is to find places in which there are said to be portals in which entities can cross over to ours. The episodes often include guests and try to capture verifiable evidence of the existence of ghosts and demons. Each outing is tense and extremely atmospheric, and evidence is often captured using up-to-date technology and various scientific methods such as EVP, electronic voice phenomena. The dynamic between Weidman and Osborne comes across well in the show, and for fans of paranormal reality, this series is one not to be missed. Number 9. Missing 411 Prime Missing 411 is an exceptionally unsettling documentary available on Amazon Prime. Following the work of investigator and author David Politis, who used to work in law enforcement, this offering follows on the trails of five children who went missing in the wilds of North America at different times. Released in 2016, Missing 411 hits high on the creepy scale, and not only does it deal with the unsolved cases of missing children, it also examines some very spooky possibilities and explanations for why and how they vanished. Politis has been, for many years now, investigating the circumstances surrounding unusual disappearances. The cases he has explored in great detail have resulted in many published books and in well-researched presentations on YouTube. He has a significant following for his work and for trying to find answers to some unsolved mysteries. The Missing 411 documentary is one of the best when it comes to missing persons cases, and is definitely one to tune in for if you are a Prime subscriber. If you are not subscribed, perhaps check out Politis' channel on YouTube, where you can find a wealth of information for free. Number 8. American Murder, The Family Next Door, Netflix American Murder, The Family Next Door is an eerie documentary in which the murder of a young wife and mother is investigated. Released in 2020, the film runs at just under 90 minutes. With high ratings across the board, this Jenny Popplewell-directed offering follows the 2018 disappearance of Shannon Watts and her two children. What makes this documentary so engaging is the use of real interviews, real excerpts from the social media accounts of those involved, and actual home camera footage and transcripts. Everything in the film feels exceptionally presented, making you feel as if you were there among the family and those involved in the case. The account that is presented is extremely shocking and graphic, and there are many uneasy moments within it. At once, this documentary is both horrific and upsetting, and yet it does the case justice in the way it is presented and written by director Popplewell. For true crime addicts, this is one to watch. Number 7. Finding Kendrick Johnson, Prime Finding Kendrick Johnson is a documentary in which the case of the mysterious death of teen Kendrick Johnson is explored. Kendrick's body was found inside a school gym under mysterious circumstances, and the case has been shrouded in mystery with hints of a cover-up ever since. This 2021 documentary, which runs at 1 hour 40 minutes, explores the case of Kendrick's death deeply. Directed by Jason Pollock, it contains interviews with family members of the deceased, and it offers an insight into the case which has gripped the imagination of many. Kendrick was found dead, rolled up inside a school gymnasium mat. Initial autopsy results were challenged and a second was performed, to a different outcome. A shocking and disturbing case, Finding Kendrick Johnson is a must-see for people interested in true crime. It's a fascinating film which sheds light on a significant case which occurred in 2013. Even after all this time, opinions are mixed on the case. Number 6. Ghost Adventures, Discovery and Prime 
No list detailing the creepiest shows to stream would be complete without including the hit paranormal series Ghost Adventures. The show stars lead investigator and author Zach Bagans, with team members Aaron Goodwin, Billy Tolley, and Jay Wasley. During each episode, the team travel across the world to investigate haunted locations, which has resulted in some of the most dramatic evidence and footage to ever have been caught on camera. Bagans is a legend in the paranormal field, and it's easy to see why. With over 20 seasons of Ghost Adventures under his belt, as well as various spin-off shows and full-length documentaries, Zack has become somewhat of a gang leader when it comes to paranormal investigation. The Ghost Adventures series, which is available on Prime as well as Discovery, runs at about 45 to 50 minutes per episode. Each outing follows the team as they travel to different locations in the hope of catching paranormal activity on camera. Needless to say, they managed to film some fascinating material, both visual and audio. If you're looking for a creepy reality show, this one is worth a try. Now I want to ask you directly, yes you right there watching this video, are there any creepy TV shows or documentaries or even YouTube videos that you know about that you really want to shout out about to get more people to watch? Well, this is your time. Make sure you let us know in the comments down below and while you're there give us a like and a subscribe, you know the usual stuff. And if you do want to give me a follow, I am at strawn87 across all social media, come and talk to me about all things horror on there. Alright, now back to the list. Number 5. Hostage to the Devil, Netflix Hostage to the Devil is a documentary available on Netflix and is one of the creepiest when it comes to the occult, paranormal, and demonic possession. It was released in 2016 and tells the true life account of a Catholic priest, Father Malachi Martin, as he takes part in several cases of alleged demonic possession and performs the rite of exorcism. Directed by Marty Stalker and based on the actual book written by the priest himself, this 90 minute doc offers a deep insight into the world of possession and exorcism. Detailing the life of the priest, as well as offering interviews, clips, and audio of exorcisms, The Hostage to the Devil makes for quite uncomfortable viewing at times. Deeply disturbing events touch Father Malachi's life, and the experiences he had during his time performing the rite makes for very interesting, albeit creepy, viewing. If you like this documentary, it's worth checking Checking out the book too. Hostage to the Devil by Father Malachi Martin details five cases of modern day possession in America and is truly unsettling reading. It makes a perfect partner to the documentary. Number 4. Ted Bundy Falling for a Killer Prime Ted Bundy is one of the most infamous serial killers of all time. It was back in the 1970s that Bundy was eventually caught and he confessed, eventually, to killing 30 women across several states in America. His crimes have been well documented through a wealth of books, films, and TV shows, yet there apparently is never quite enough to be said about this topic. Falling for a Killer, currently shown on Prime, is a five episode crime series which focuses on Ted's victims, something the show received praise for. Directed by Trish Wood, episodes run between 37 and 52 minutes. Elizabeth Kendall was Ted Bundy's girlfriend, and each episode offers a dark insight into their life, their relationship, and what it was like living with the person who became one of the most hated men in history. Much like anything else related to this notorious figure, there are a lot of dark moments and uncomfortable revelations, yet that's what makes this series worth a watch. We rarely get the insight from people close to these figures. Ever wondered what it's really like sleeping with the enemy? And by that, I mean a real life enemy and not the earlier Julia. Roberts movie, which by the way is low key a great movie and performance by Roberts. Nevertheless, you should watch this documentary and find out. Number 3 Demon House Discovery Paranormal investigator and TV host Zach Bagans, yes he pops up on this list again, as after all he has been exploring the world of the afterlife for many years. Whether it's on one of our previous entries, Ghost Adventures, or his haunted museum show, the star has been serving the chills to audiences across the world on a regular basis. Here though, we take a look at the feature length documentary Demon House, which ranks as one of the spookiest projects the presenter has ever involved himself with. The origins of the infamous Demon House began in 2011, when a family who were living in the property began to experience a dark and frightening haunting and claimed to have been part of a demonic possession. When the house went up on the market, who else was better to purchase it than Bagans? He put in an offer, sight unseen, and bought the house in an attempt to uncover the truth behind the infamous property. Demon House runs at approximately 90 minutes and is the result of Bagans' efforts as he investigates the history of the property and attempted to make contact with whatever entity was said to reside there. The film is super creepy very tense and features plenty of footage that will satisfy students of the paranormal. Number 2. Unsolved Mysteries, Netflix 
Unsolved Mysteries is currently streaming on Netflix and so far there have been three seasons of this superbly crafted show, which hits the creep factor in all the right ways. Each episode runs at 45 minutes and details unusual accounts and cases that have never been explained, understood or solved. If you like watching eerie shows like me, there's truly something for everyone in this series as it covers most subjects of a dark and disturbing nature. Whether it's cases of unsolved murders, missing people, paranormal encounters or perplexing cases that have baffled authorities, Unsolved Mysteries has it all. Unsolved Mysteries is a hugely popular show and doesn't refrain from touching upon the most weird or outlandish cases. If you only give one episode a go, make it mystery on the rooftop in the first season. After that, trust us, you'll be addicted. Number 1. Disappeared Discovery the series Disappeared has been streaming on the Discovery Channel for several years. It began in 2009 and is still going today, having amassed an impressive 10 series so far. With so many episodes available online, it is perfect viewing for those who like to binge their shows, and each episode runs at about 45 minutes. So, what's it all about? Well, it's all in the title. Each episode of Disappeared takes a true life unsolved case of a missing person and investigates, interviews and revisits the events leading up to the disappearance. In many of the episodes, there are very dark issues being dealt with, as expected, but it is the fact that these people were never found that brings a shiver up the spine. How do these people vanish without a trace? To watch Disappeared serves as a reminder that anything can happen to those we love at any moment, and that is enough to unsettle most of us. Most of the time, we can watch shows such as these on TV or film and feel a safe distance from them, but these stories feel all too real and show how such things can impact anyone at any time.